Hello, I'm David and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about Darshan today. What is Darshan? Well, Darshan is a divine blessing given in the form of a light transmission. Traditionally, it's given in a one-to-one -one situation where the student kneels before the teacher and the light is passed from heart to heart through the eyes. But the light is actually given through the heart of the teacher from the universe. So what the student receives is a transmission directly from universal consciousness into their heart and this is provided for what they need in the moment. I first began to give Darshan in 2016. Something had been building up in me for about a year before. I was constantly being asked by the light to look into students' eyes very, very deeply. And so I knew there was a change coming, but I wasn't really sure what it was. I had a feeling it might be the ability to give Darshan, but I wasn't certain. And in February 2016, a colleague and student came to see me to stay for a few days teaching. And during this few days, the subject of Darshan came up and we discussed it. And she said to me, well, I know you're going through changes at the moment, and I acknowledge that. And as a spiritual teacher, we constantly go through a kind of death and rebirth. So the falling away of the old and then the stepping up into the new. It's quite an interesting process, but it can be quite difficult as well. So discussing the Darshan, we decided, well, we better give it a go and see, is this what it's meant to be? See, is this what is actually happening? So we prepared ourselves in the traditional way. I went into a silent meditation space. She went into a silent meditation space. And then we were ready. She came and kneeled before me. And I allowed the light to flow through my heart, through my eyes, into her eyes and into her heart. No sooner had the process begun when the light that came through me was absolutely incredible. I've experienced many, many interesting and powerful experiences on the spiritual path, but nothing like this. It knocked the two of us out for about an hour. As we came round, she lay on the sofa, I was collapsed in the chair. And the process of the light coming in was pouring into me. I knew what was happening, I knew this was light, but what light does is trigger immense fear within you. So I'm going through a process of saying, don't stop it, don't stop it, please allow the light to come. And it came and it came and it came and then it's, it seemed to stop, it kind of dwindled out, came to an end. As it kind of came to a completion, it was as if my whole life gave this sigh of relief and I got this sense and heard these words, you have arrived. I wasn't really sure where I'd arrived or what I'd arrived at, but it was a life-changing moment, there's no doubt about it. This release was incredible. For some 25 years, the light had been driving me and driving me and driving me forwards all the time. And suddenly everything let go and I went into this process of surrender. Well, of course, the Darshan had been incredible for the two of us. But what I needed to know next was, was this the next step? Was this the next step in my development? And so uh, my colleague, Tim, in London, I asked him, would he organise a Darshan in London? And we did it the traditional way. There was about 25 people. Tim and, uh, and Lynn prepared the space. I went into my meditation for about an hour before. When everything was ready, Tim gave me a shout. I came into the room. Tim brought the people up one at a time. I passed the darshan. And when it was all complete, I left the room again. Tim and Lynn then wound everything down, brought everybody back into the space. 
and then uh, as people gave their feedback they recorded it so that I could hear it later so what we did in fact discover several people had what they would describe as a divine experience something way beyond anything they'd experienced before so after that event I knew that this was the next step so for about 18 months I went on the road uh, giving darshan to various groups here and there up and down the country and in fact in Europe and after about 18 months the light asked me to stop going out and giving it on the road and to develop a distant darshan process so today and since that time so this last five or six years I've been offering a distant darshan once a month or sometimes once every three weeks you can sign up to this anytime you like people from all over the world take this darshan if you sign up to the mailing list link below you will be notified when the darshan is coming up and then you can register so I hope you've enjoyed this little introduction to Darshan, what it is, and how I present it. And I do hope to see you there soon. Bye for now.